Hello, Cosmetil here, Excellent and thank you for joining home. me. We're on the floor for some reason. So, uh, we're going to be continuing the uh, playthrough of We Happy Few in this video. And we left off just after someone broke into our house and wouldn't stop, wouldn't leave. And then, incidentally, our house set on fire. And the person who broke in got set on fire. And then they died. So, you know, happy ending, all in all. Um, we found the baby's milk for the baby, so... Gwen is no longer dying at first, which, you know, happy days. Yes, yes. Mommy's gonna feed you. Don't look it's a very big eyes. ugly looking baby, I'm not gonna lie, it's a no terrible... No uh, ever fed you ever, have they? I don't know, Sprite, me, or just whatever you call it, it just does not look nice at all. But, yeah, um, so yeah, we, ha we need to travel to the Boyle residence now. Because uh, our house set on fire, partially. And we need to replace some of the equipment. So we can make blueberry or blackberry one of the joys. It is 11am. Which means no one is going to try to kill us from being out of our house. We've got tons of sunshine. Hmm. It's interesting. We're not allowed in that house for some reason. Yeah, so this person's uh, slightly far away from us. Not too far though, but a little bit of a distance. Oh, we got a button by here, which means they're in the garden district. Well, oh, fantastic. At least we can run now, I guess. Ah, yeah, so I'm wearing fancy clothes now. Let's see if my perk worked. No, it lied. It said that I got a perk. I'll even show it to you now. This one. You look like you belong there, even when you don't. Oh, it was for clothes. All right, let the game off. So we're gonna get this one just to some other people in their sleep because that's gonna be useful. Uh, we grab this one as well, and we'll get this one. We got a few perks now, so again, happy days. Um, Peachy's final mission. Is this on the way? Where's our current objective? Like our story mission game. Fuck me, it's a far away dig spot, don't I? Ah, uh, no, it's another dig spot. There's a shop down there. A shelter. So, uh, um. Oh shit! Forgot to change my clothes. Hold on. But when I had nice clothes to wear. Yeah. Some big secret. Basement, yeah, we'll grab those. But yeah, honestly, I've got to say, I'm really enjoying this wee happy few. I know some people aren't really liking it, but honestly, I was thinking about it just now, and I think this game would make a fantastic comic. Like, they made it, um, Sea of Thieves comics, they make Dark Souls comics, Bloodborne. Amongst others. Before we begin, please listen to a personal message for our prudent friend. The fox is in the hen house. Oh damn it! The fox <laughs> is in the I hen hate house. when the fox is in the hen house. <gasps> prudent friend. Do you mind? I'm a lover, not a fighter. Leave me alone. Why are people constantly trying to kill me as this character? I don't get it. And she's not very good in a fight. So I can't just baseball bat people to death like I had that option as Arthur. Alright, come on now. Triangles disappear. One, two. 
No, one went then. Or did they just overlap? There we go, one gone. What was that? Oh, we have a medical bomb. So we're not dead or dying. Um, so for some reason that person did not like me uh, stealing the sovereigns from the phone booth. Falling down, falling down, London Bridge is falling down. Don't mind me lads, I'm just stealing the coins. Not like any of you are using them. <coughs> so yeah, um, there's actually an achievement for listening to all the phone conversations. And so far we've got as far as I've got. As Arthur, I only listened to two of the conversations because I only survived for eight days before completing the game. Um, and I didn't spend a great deal of that time in the Garden District, I guess. Not that I'm sure if the phone calls are available outside of the Garden District. I just seem to only get them there. What happened to the gardens? To What's the mushroom house? Where's the, um... Ah, here it is. The puppet theater. So we've got to go on to this, in the back of the house. The game won't let me pick the fucking lock. What's it doing? Oh. Grab on, you fool. Come on. There we go. That's what I'm supposed to do. I won't I won't supposed to get him by doing it. Right, I'm going to leave that lock actually, in case I get someone's attention. <laughs> it's all good. It's all good. Aha! Let's pick a lock. Power cell. Ooh, inventory expansion. What are we looking at? We're on 80 now. 85? 100. Didn't realize I boosted by, uh, by 20. Have they kidnapped someone? Is there a reason for why I'm travelling all the way up here? Boxing shoes. What do the boxing shoes do? Run like the wind and don't break your ankle. Hmm.
Så har jeg blivet den. <laughs> Så kan jeg bleed to death. Fuck, I ran through the door. Right. Um, what the hell are we gonna do here then? Can't open that door. Have I got any items I can lob at them? Um, what, berserk dart. Inflicts very light damage, causes target to attack nearest character. That could come in handy. I've got better things to do than chase your ass across town. Yeah, but have you? At least I don't have to wear that idiotic mask anymore. The doors of perception were cleansed. We could see everything as it is. Okay, is there a window I can jump out of? Because that'll just make things a lot easier. Let's have a look for the window. <sighs> that one's blocked. Can't open that one. Hmm. Am I my brother's keeper? Am I? Oh, wait a minute. Don't think I won't Suckers. I'll take this. I'll take this. And where the fuck is the grass to hide in? Come on, tall grass. Oh, I got away. Alright, where have I got to go? Oh, I'm close to it as well. Sorted. So we've got a nice pair of boxing shoes. And we've probably got some enemies for life since we stole their boxing shoes. Oh, there's a lot of people there. I'm just gonna... Why? Why? What did I do to you? Are you the people whose boxing shoes I stole? Oh no, oh no. Don't bump into me. If they bump into you, they find you. Right, there's two gone already, so there's only two people left after me. Ah! My character's thirsty. There we go. Be gone, cretins. Alright, there we go. I'm not gonna straight stand up now, I'm gonna give it a second, like that. And where is the Boyle residence? I've lost the marker. Oh, no, I found it. Peeps. Hello. Look brighter in the morning. I saw a dead man. His lips were green. He'd been eating grass, do you see? Huh. Because he was starving. Oh, the poor sap. Poor, poor man. <gasps> Pile of rubble. Metal bits. Oh shit, my character's uh, bad mum Omita is like halfway down. She's going to be... Before we go into that house, let's see if this is going to ring. Childish phone. Let's, uh, I don't know why they care. It's not your fucking phone box, is it? Grow up, you childish bastard. Ah! That guy's got an axe. Why has he got an axe? Refuge! Refuge! Who the hell are you? Great, you got the plague. Oh, I haven't got fucking bandage. I haven't got medical balm. It's okay though, I can make some. Uh, healing balm. That's what I was referring to. 
That'll do. Maybe it won't. I can make one of you. No, wait, come on. One of you. So I need them, you see, to make um, sunshine, which is a substitute to uh, to joy. And I can't say I'm going to go for a no joy playthrough because I had to take a joy for some reason. I can't remember why, but I did. Gwen, don't be afraid of the dark. Just bring a torch. Go berserk! So he's gonna start hurting people. Me. Great. Ah! Be gone! I said be gone! Why would you. Would you oh, there's no medical bomb. Quickly! Ah! Take this! Umbrella attack! He's, he's, he's died, we've got him on the ropes. Ow. Stop hitting me back, you bastard. Ah, he's bleeding! We've got him on the ropes! Haha! <laughs> you suck. Thomas Hughes? What it, you Oh, he was hallucinating. Poor guy. Oh shit, there's more. There's more of the drugged up wonders. Rubber duck. I've got a book. Metal tube. Can I make something? Because I'm going to get my ass handed to me if I try to get into a fight here. There's no denying that. A fucking dart. Yeah, that's going to do the trick. I need to make... Uh, what do I need to make? Where are you? I had a thing for knocking people out. Where the fuck has he gone? Come on, where are you? A knock... Yeah, that could help. A knockout syringe. But that's not what I'm trying to find. Is it down here? No, but a vomit bombs are fantastic, actually. I love those. Can I only make it at my, um... My desk in the house? Now, let's try jumping on this. That's very weird. There's, um, there's a, like... A weapon! Basically, that she uses. The game even tells you about it in her tutorial. I haven't got one. Problem is, with this character as well, you can't actually. Um, Looks like the plagues can come through those holes in the barbed wire. Not a good place to sleep, then. <coughs> At least I can still use the hatch to get onto the Wellington undertracks. If one of them was asleep, I could smother them in its in his sleep. But that's about it. There. As easy as unhooking a bra. Now I can come <laughs> back whenever I like. Yeah. Now you just gotta worry about all the guys with the plague. Notice footsteps. No, we don't, need, we don't need to notice footsteps. <coughs> what we need is able to kick people in the face really hard. Double damage when health is critical. I'm going to have to buy that. Is someone sleeping by any chance? Oh, yeah, I can grab these. Yes, a cleaver. That should do the trick. Cleave someone's face off. Can she use a cleaver? She can. Oh, no. 
course I can use a cleaver. But I don't fucking bring it out, do I? Come on, get over here, you bastard. Come on. That's right, mate. That's right. No jolly brawly for you. Fucking cleaver. Alright, we got rid of him. What's your name, son? Stop moving. Alf Gilbert. Terribly sorry, Alf. Right, how many, uh, how many left is there? I think there's two over on this side. <coughs> now we've got the two of them after us at once now. Which is not preferable. So we're gonna run away now. Get our heel on. Alright, one left. No, 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 no. Hiya! Oh, didn't matter. Ooh, no oh, memory. I'll take that screw. I was actually trying to get my tea so I could. Um oh, I'm out of tea. Well, that's terrible news. Oh, wait a minute. So I wish I weren't such rubbish at tinkering. So because she's not very good at tinkering, she can't fix this place up. Which means if I come here, there's a chance there's going to be plague victims all the time, or what? I need to contract the plague. There's an achievement for uh, contracting and curing the plague. What was that? Loose screws. Hmm. It's quite interesting, though, the way how the game changes up a little bit. What have you got for me, then, son? Nothing. Let's find our memory. Preggers. So mod. I can't tell if Mrs. Witherington is preggers or just fat. Don't use that word, it's horrible. Her husband is a prisoner of war, but she goes everywhere with Lieutenant Olbricht. Maybe she's just eating extra rations. Anyway, if we'll you're not, what months, I'm saying. You can't tell either way. That dress rations is so referring to penis. That's enough of that, Sully Boyle. Alright. Nothing more to do in here, I guess, so... Does that mean... Can I sleep here? I can. Can I? I can. We're not going to sleep, though, because we have a baby in this, uh... This act of the game. And we can't risk the baby... Well, I don't think the baby can die, but we're not going to find out, basically. We're going to pretend the baby can die, and we're going to play accordingly. No phone call? Childish. Travel to the Boyle residence. Oh, we got a cutscene. Ah. Well, young Miss Boyle. You know oh, the shit, this is my house. You know I, I forgot her name was Boyle. You? Sorry, sir. Let's get you home. You had another fight with your mum, didn't you? Why don't I put in a good word? Uh, Mrs. Boyle, I've got a young lady out here who, um... I'm sorry. They don't seem to be at home. What? Let me go in. They're not at home. Let me take you to the station for a cup of tea. What happened? Let me in. Best you don't go in, miss. Cup of tea's best. What did she do? What did she do? What, what did she do? Wow. Oh, wow. This is unexpected. Oh, shit. Uh, oh, shit. 
I'm not going to read it all. I'll leave it on the screen through there so you can like uh, have a quick uh, scan through it. But now I'm going to shuffle through these to make sure that all the stars go. Cause Father Boyle. Yeah, I'm sure that's what his name was. And Mother Boyle. Mum said, you don't have to worry about the train. No one's going on the train. Shut up, Sally. You're a big girl. Stop crying. Yeah, because you know the song. Big girls don't cry and all that jazz. Oh, what a cheap bookcase. No. Oh. You're not Mother Boyle, are you? No. You are trespassing. Oh, you've got some nerve. Let me tell you. This is the Boyle residence. Fucking trespassing. I'll... Oh. Where's her mum gone? On that note. But, well, to be fair, the Bobbies back then may have actually done a decent job at stuff. <laughs> ah! Get out of me house, you bastard! Uh. And you, gone, be gone. <laughs> Feel the wrath. Ah, stop hitting me. And let me hit you, you childish people. How dare you have self preservation? Better you than me. Who said that? Was that me? Come on, give me your things. Why do people have nothing? Why? That's a fucking tall desk. Yeah, like I believe the TV would still be working. What's that? Are you dead? Oh, I've got no oh, what's this? Cloth? <gasps> a duck! Give me the duck! What's up with this audio? <laughs> yeah, that's right, son. What do you got? No, what do you got, mate? I've got a cleaver. Yeah. Let's have a brewski. Filing cabinet, nothing. Derek Pritchard. He's one of those big desks that apparently don't have drawers. So my room is the only room which was locked. Have a cup of tea. And just turn that off. That is to say, first aid. Oh yes, that's what I'm talking about. Empty syringes. How how old were you? Why the hell you got joy and empty syringes and a bathroom in your? What the hell? We're gonna. Were you a rich family? 
Or is you just a spoilt daughter? Beaker, a thermostat, N7 triode. I think I can fix my lab. I turn that TV on was such a bad idea. I proper like shit myself and started getting proper chills then. Fucking Uncle Jack, uh, yeah, Uncle Jack talking. <laughs> Weirdly, apparently, these guys don't take kindly to you walking on with a machete, or a cleaver, in this case. At least that's one believable thing about these guys in this district. What was that? Mm. Nighttime only kind of thing, apparently. Um, how far have we got to go? Oh yeah, I don't know why I had to take a joy help. now. I needed to get but back in from the garden district. But you need to take a joy or a sunshine to get through. And since I hadn't made sunshines yet, I had to take a joy. Oh. Out of the way, boulder. I can't see anything. What have we got? Will help us make some medicine for the lads. You got a phone call for me? No. Beeps. How's it hanging? At least the war is over. Empty. Run away. Run away. See, there's joy detectors, but there now. So we can take a sunshine by here, which is not joy, but people think it is. And then check on wrong way our nice clothes. We won't put our proper shoes on because it should be fine with the boxing shoes. Let's have a look at you, shall we? Shall we? Tip-top shape, aren't you? Ah, right. They're, not, they're checking to, to see if I have a disease or not. Ah. I didn't realise that. I never... I guess I never really paid attention. <laughs> so I must repair my lab and, incidentally, feed my baby. Ah. <sighs> Bit of in-game loading for you. Oh, I got Pepsi. I just remembered that. I haven't had Pepsi in those in ages. Been drinking lots of tea, and it has nothing to do with we happy few. I guess I add to the stereotype of British people because I love tea. Yeah, <sighs> fucking shambles. Let's go feed the baby first. Baby's a bit more important. Tell you, I can't wait to get you an automatic feeder. Tim milk tastes like a razor's, but you don't know any better, do you? Well, at least it's healthy. There we go. Install baby feeder. Requires baby feeder. Really? If we hold the baby in our arms, our character gets a fatigue and stamina boost because they feel like a good mum. It makes them feel better, like mentally and emotionally. It can't be your daddy because he's a. Well, I think he's a bit of a psychopath. And I suppose if I were with him, the moment you went to sleep, he'd want attention for himself, and then I'd be so desperately tired I'd bludgeon him to death. And wouldn't we be in a pickle then? <laughs> he would bludgeon him to death. Well, if what if you meant what I thought you meant when you said take care of you, 
any good parent, mother or father, would bludgeon someone to death if they wanted to hurt their child. Any parent worth their salt. Let's get rid of those bricks. Oh, I sell those. Have I got any um bottles in here? Nine. Four. Wait, is that a sunshine pill? Oh, that's a pie. <laughs> I'm also going to take these because, for some reason, rotten food goes for a decent, uh, decent price. Couldn't tell you why, but they eat like two pound each. They buy them. It's crazy. It's like people want to have food poisoning. Be ill. There we go. Now I just need to replace all my chemicals. Sweet. Stuart. I've got to talk to Stuart. Maybe he's got the chemicals I need squirreled away somewhere. Find the components for Blackberry Joy. Well, what are the components? Don't just tell me find the components. What are they? Goodbye to all that. Ah, yeah, that guy about in his mojo nonsense. So I'm supposed to go back and see him in 24 hours. So we'll go sleep now. Yeah. Yeah. Do, 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 do. Oh, look, my kitchen cleaned itself as well. I right, come on then, Bambino, we're going to go sleep. And you better not be ready for feeding once you wake up. It's eight, so we're gonna go for twelve hours. So it's eight in the morning. God, you're a good baby sleeping with all this music on. And you're a good human sleeping with all this music on as well. To be fair, I fucking would have come down and st would have destroyed that table hours ago if I was me trying to sleep eight hours with that on. Right, uh, let's go do this. He should just be around the corner. Unless it hasn't been 24 hours yet, although I'm pretty sure it must have been. Alright, kind of been. Um, come back in three days if it hasn't been one day. All the key ingredients, alright. Visit the chemist. Seems like a reasonable place to go find chems, doesn't it? How far are you away, Ryan? Alright, the other side of the town. Typical. What is this? Is this the doctor's house? I have, I bought an invitation to get into some place. Don't join. Let's talk to him. Hello, nice Constable Hunt. You, uh, can I come in? Guess not. Alright. Bit of a waste of a sunshine. Ooh. Pork rubber. I wonder, can you break these? Because you could on... Well, not these ones, but... Should clear up soon, I imagine. Right as rain. Right as rain. Lovely day for it. Quickly, in case I need to go past a downer scanner. Right as rain, right as Bloody rain. Revolvers. No! There's sunshine somewhere, haven't I? Fuck. Whoa, I got proper lucky then. Fucking 
thing ran out as I was walking, as I was getting scanned. Or literally just before I got scanned. Oh, cheeky swine. Uh, have we got anything going on around here? So look at the map. There's a shop there. Oh, yeah, that's, um, yeah, okay. Shop here. Corner pub. Alright. Alterations. Goodbye to all that. Oh, yeah, yeah, okay. I should do that quest on the way back. Thankfully, because I... Well, look at you. Hmm. No one seems to notice I, that I'm not on my joy. Like, at all. Except for the TV screens, they notice. Sunshine, lollipops, and rainbows everywhere. Right as rain, right as rain. Ooh. Probably early day doctor, isn't it? Well, if it isn't Sally Boyle. Himself is upstairs tinkering. When will he be? It's been weeks now. It's a device you left behind. Apparently, it's quite clever and complex. Ooh. I just came to buy some chemicals. Over my cold, dead body. Fiona. It's not just borrowing my man while you were here. I could have got over that. It's the ambitions you put into him. Fiona, I'm sorry. He wants to be more than a village chemist. How's that, I says? Will you go to London to study to be a doctor? Will you take over Hayworth Labs? She still wouldn't take you back, I says. But you sold him the stars. And now he can't barely see where he's going. Maybe he liked me because I thought he could be more. Do you ever think of that? Get out of here. Get out, you witch. And don't let the door hit you in the arse on the way out. Fight. Was able to do anything, I would kick the yeah. shit into you, but that She's window's mellowed. coming. Fiona said Stuart's been working on my old pituitary extractor. Maybe. Maybe I can get it back from him later. When she's not in the shop. Wait. Harry Cavendish. He still works for the labs, doesn't he? And he owes me a favour. I'll drop by his house. Alright, good. At least he doesn't live far away. I have enough. Oh, I've done it. Fuck, I've got 13. Alright, so what can we do? Get better prices when buying. Oh, yes, I'll take that. Heal better. Find fancier loot. Fancier loot. Carry more weight. That's the next one. Go for these two next. Fancy. Which house have I got to go into? I'm sorry. I, I I will never do it again. Thank goodness. You gave me quite the fright. Harry? It's Sally. Uh, Sally Boyle. Just a moment. Just a moment, damn it. I can't get to the door as fast as I used to. Alright. What's wrong with you? Sally Boyle. Well, I haven't seen you in a dog's age. What? What happened to your eyes? Oh, this little thing. A doctor used miscalculated the brominating reaction and it blew up in my face. Oh. Then he convinced Dr. Verloc it was my fault. So I got the sack. That weasel. Oh, you don't have to pretend you're interested in the tedious old lab. How's the glamorous life of an experimental chemist? It's a bit blocked at the moment. Can't get mercury amalgam. Did you know they vent gallons of it onto Rat Home? Oh, well, you wouldn't. You've moved on to greener pastures. I'm sorry. I thought Anton knew what he was doing. Oh, I don't blame you for leaving us all behind. When love fades, you have to move on. Well, I'm sure you'll figure out where to find some amalgam. Maybe I will. But someone's got to prove it was Dr. Hughes's fault you lost your eyes. You know, you're right. He could hurt someone else. 
Is there <laughs> any evidence that it was his fault? You know, now that you mention it, his lab notes. He keeps them in his doctor bag. I bet they're all the evidence I need. Oh, you know what? I bet they'd also tell me how to extract the amalgam you need out of the stuff the lab is piping onto Rat Home. I'll get you his lab notes. Here's where he lives. Come back, and I'll tell you where to find the pump outlet. Don't go anywhere. Wouldn't dream of it. <laughs> oh, blind jokes. How far away does he live? Oh, all so close. Happy days. Right as rain. Well. Alright. Alright. He's a man of few words. You're looking very tall today. Watch out for scurvy. I don't think you. Oh shit. Itchy ear, itchy ear. Didn't realize there was a doctor so close to me. Um, what is it? Ah. Was it by here? Oh, see, these bins are basically empty in this playthrough for some reason. Ah! What the hell? Little park for kids, but there's no kids. What's that to anyone? Stoyal Doctor uses bag. Well, as soon as I find out where his bloody house is, I'll steal anything from him. Well, Even his life. You can't say Dr. Hughes doesn't have a keen sense of style. I'd better be particularly I'm careful in there. Sense of humor. If he knows I'm there, it'll get nasty fast. Run, but you can't hide. Fuck, man. That, uh... <laughs> that was unexpected. Where's the knockout syringe? What do I need? Knockout juice. Sweet. What do I need? Night Blossom. Fire's locked back. Let's wait for him to go in the house so I can close the door behind me and then stab the shit into his face. Or not. Lovely day. When they made you, they broke the mold. Oh fuck. Fucking mad bastard. Aha! Oh look, you've been beaten by a girl. Yeah, a girl was gonna fucking die. The thing is, these guys have like medical bomb and shit. So it's first aid kit, see? These guys all have medical stuff being 
crazy fucking doctors and all. Just give me the rotten onion and the rotten mushroom and the cupboard stuff and the mouldy bread. Get up, man, woman, person. Close the door. Now we'll just use a healing bomb now because they are less potent. Thought you were. <laughs> Oh, I didn't think I were anything, boy. Then well, this is your, your maker. More satisfying than undermining the other girl's confidence. More satisfying than undermining another girl's confidence. Women can be mean by the sounds of it. Used up. What the hell is that? Ten sovereign Jimmy. Oh, berserk dot. What was that? All right. All right. Oh, a lock. Dash. I hate when we get a locked desk and it's fuck, like, fuck all in it. So why are you locked? Upstairs. So there's a doctor there. Are there any other doctors? My hands through the wall. Ah. Did you think I wouldn't? No, I thought you'd notice me all more. I was counting on it. No. No throwing. We do not appreciate flowing in this household, young man. Sally, your customer relations leave something to be desired. Is it a vomit bomb? Smoke bomb. Vomit bombs are so much better. As the name would suggest, they make people vomit. A diary. Right, what have you got for me, son? Give me your bleach. And give me your zompak toe. Stiff upper lip. I don't want to sleep. I don't care if we've potentially killed all the doctors. I do not trust this house. I think they'll come back and kill me in my sleep. Or like our first playthrough. Give me the dreaded coconut joy. Dun, dun, dun. This must be the bag Harry wanted. I wonder what happens by here if, if I didn't kill all of the doctors. Would I get attacked? Yeah. Well, lads, it was a really nice visit. I'm glad you was able to check this pimple on my ass and make sure there's nothing worse than just a pimple. But I really must be going. We all appreciate what you do. Quite a sturdy bag. I wonder if Gwen would fit in here. She'd need to be able to breathe. 
some source of oxygen and soundproofing in case she starts crying. I bet Lionel could make something like that. Ah. Harry? It's Sally. Uh, Sally Boyle. Just a moment. Just a moment, damn it. I can't get to the door as fast as I used to. That's the exact same audio clip as before. Did you get Dr. Hughes's bag? I've got it. Aren't you Brillo? Well, Brillo. here's the formula you'll need. You can get to Rat Home via the maintenance tunnels. There's a code at the door. It's 1649. I really am sorry about the accident. I thought Anton had a handle on things. Well, now we know. Cheerio. Tidy bye. Like other babies, Gwen needs to have her diaper changed. Attend to her before time runs out. Oh. I'll I didn't realize there was a timer. Before I Let's look at the map. Shady dealer. Uh, there's a shelter by here, so I'll fast travel from the shelter to here. Pick up this side quest, turn in this side quest, and go oh. there. I can get there from any hatch now that I've got the code. Um, I'll keep my sunshine at hand in case a doctor appears, like that one there. He's not coming near me though, so we're all good for now. You can take your joy immediately. Nope. You're in a headmistress. Only headmistresses mis can make me take joy immediately. Get out of there. No. <laughs> you ain't telling me what to do. I like how some of these are already fixed, like, well, it feels like they do it so it creates the impression that Arthur is playing at the same time as Sally. So it's like, oh, you know, at this point in the game we can pretend he would have sorted this bit out, but I got to one of the, um, the shelters before him, and which is why, oh, fuck, that's a terrifying looking bit why uh, Sally didn't fix the hole because as she says she's not very uh, craftsy so she's she can't fix it look at that weight just drop oh, look at that. Oh, oh. 65 64 still 64 63 Okay. Disappearing. <laughs> they are nearly broke. It's a slightly less damage. I can't even use this. Like it's a heavy weapon. I need to find someone to sell these bottles too, because I got loads and uh, the, uh, the, f the rotten food. I wish I weren't such rubbish at tinkering. So does that mean the next character that I play as, whoever his name is, is going to be like, shit at science but amazing at tinkering? Hallucinogen. Chlorine. Black powder. Ah, this is it. Atomizer. This is what I needed to make. I need beads and ten butterflies. Huh. I didn't know you could get butterflies. Oh, there's a book. A diary. Alright. Uh, screw all that. Travel. We want to travel here. Wrong one, apparently.
Status effect continue to increase and decrease. Where shall we wander today? Now entering St. George's home. This is St. George's home. Not home. Home. What is it? Summer Slam kickoff. What, Summer Slam now? Biggest party of the summer, isn't it? These tracks would be so much nicer with trains. Wouldn't they? Wouldn't they, though? We like the dream, wouldn't they, love? Right, so we're gonna come out, put our right. Go back to this, there's no doctors around here, so. Be free to. So we wanna turn right. Ah, turn right, and then there's that new side quest. Is it this woman? Sorry, moustache. Hello there, love. There you are. Right as rain. Right oh, as right rain. you are. There is rain. How did you know? Lovely that? weather. All right. So there's a side quest here somewhere, apparently. Lovely weather for it. Not a clue where it is. Oh, what's this? Mrs. Pankhurst is a shop. How long has she had a shop? I shouldn't be surprised. That woman could sew a wedding suit for an octopus. Uh, lay lay it on, on me. Ground. I want none of that crap. But I want to give you some of my crap. See? Free! Look at that for rotten mushrooms. Fuck yeah. Um Yeah, I'm sure you want the hallucinogenic mushroom dunno. Uh what else have I got here that, that I can sell? It's got eighteen for his fucking hell, yeah. Take the two. Um is there anyone else? What does Sunshine's got for? Only four. Wow. Ah, here we go, glass bottles, three each. I perfectly steal all your money. Pow. There we go. Not today, I'm afraid. Can you believe I blew it all on these hair. boots? Where's um, this woman's shop then? Right, Sally's shop says it's over here. This way. Oh, here it is. Ah, oh, so it's upstairs. Now, this is already starting to look bad. Don't be another scotch. Yoo-hoo! Come on, dearie. Mrs. Pankhurst! How have you been? Couldn't be better. I was having dizzy spells, but they've gone away. Isn't that wonderful? When things just sort of... Cure themselves. Oh, the I've best. been meaning to go visit the reform club, but my old outfit. Uh, I seem to have filled out a bit since then, if you can believe that. Oh, remember when I made you that lovely nurse's uniform for the reform club? You know, I've always wanted to visit there. Wanda's such a good friend of mine, but she never tells me what goes on there. I imagine they drink tea and discuss how to reform government and things like that. Sort of. Not exactly. Can't <laughs> you wangle me an invitation? I keep asking my friend Wanda and she always promises, but somehow it's always next week. I ought to be able to manage that. If you could get me an invitation, I'd be ever so thrilled. We could go together. I'll come by when you've got one. I got Your one. Your new outfit should be done by then. I've already got one. I got you. I wish I'd learned to sew. Well, I don't wish it. I'd probably have become a seamstress like Mum. Oh, no. Oh, 
I'm not much of a night owl anyway. I just hate being excluded, you know. Oh, I've made your outfit for you. It's ever so slimming. I think you'll look wonderful in it. Oh, you always look wonderful. You're yeah. such a dear. What would I do without you? Come by any time you need something new to wear. It's such a joy making clothes for you. You always make me look so good. Let's really go then, love. Oh, it's been too long. Thought I'd pop in to see what's new. Reinforced padded suit. Chic padded suit. Burglar suit. <laughs> Makes you hard to see in the dark if you don't move. Upset people, oh no. upsets people if they do see you. Makes you hard to see in the shadow. Does not conceal your movement. All right. Sneak thief outfit. So this has less visibility or more visibility. I think less. Rubber cat suit. All right. Yeah. So I have a very high visibility. So the burglar suit has a lower visibility than the sneak thief. Riding boots, army boots. Medium armor, but noisy and exhaust your stamina faster when sprinting. Okay. I will grab a pair of sneaky shoes. And we will take a burglar. This is worth more. Makes you much sneakier. Makes it harder to see you in the dark. So this makes me okay. We'll go for the for this one. As ultimate protection. All right. Okay. So okay, we get this one. Now we'll sell. What can I sell to you? Out of the nonsense that I have. Do you fancy some uh, glass bottles, by any chance? You do. You wait. I knew he was the kind of woman who likes glass bottles. I've got a brick you can have. Oh, we've got an achievement. Baby, you're... That's, that was my uh, my uh, thousandth pound. I'm, I'm, I'm honoured to have shared this moment with you guys. Um... Yeah, that, that looks a bit like about it, because for some reason... Oh, scotch. Get rid of that. So now, if we go to our outfits, we got a few. The ultimate protection from disagreements in the village. By the miracle of Miss... Park hosts sewing talents. No one will realize you're practically armored. Absorbs damage from attacks. Resists infections. Conf uh, conforms in the village. All right, so I can wear it here, and people won't want to kill me for looking like an idiot. What am I wearing? Boxing shoes. We will check our proper shoes on now. Then I wear my not so uh, put on my not so brawly, jolly brawly. And now let's make our way home. We're on the way, so I want to go straight across, go down. No, I don't. I want to go down here. Otherwise, I'm just making it way longer for myself. You take your joy in me. Never! Right, from here... Turn left at the second one, which is this one. Yeah, because then my house is by here, so... House is on my right. So what's this? Oh, fuck's sake, it's the map marker I made. So I was wondering what all that was about. Use any tra uh, track access hatch to travel to Rat Home. Oh, my bad. Oh, well, it's all good. Let's go talk to this guy and find out if his wife loves him. 
in fact. Ah, oh, there he is. Ah, oh, he's crying. Did you give her her joy? She never loved me. She went blabbering on about some childhood sweetheart who left on a train. Apparently, he made quite the impression. Did you give her her joy? I almost didn't. I thought Trollope deserves to be in the garden district. She only stayed with me to avoid the unpleasantness of breaking it off. You haven't taken your own joy, have you? Joy doesn't help. You never really forget, do you? It just makes things fuzzy around the edges, you know? So you can pretend. I want to forget her forever. I'm not sure Oblivion exists. Please. You want my mojo recipe, don't you? Forgetting could be dangerous. Are you going to make me do more? It's not like joy. There'll be holes in your memory. Like a church made out of cheese and the whole congregation is mice. You might forget more than you want to. I don't care. It's fair trade. Your future for my past. What do you want me to do? Here. Here's the recipe for oblivion. I tell you not to tell anyone where you got it. But there's very little danger of that. Goodbye, Benedict. I've got my eye on you. Poor guy. Right as rain, right as rain. So we gotta go back to the baby now. And we must change the baby's bum, basically. What do I need for you again? Oh, yeah. <sighs> oh, I can't believe how difficult this game... Oi! We must catch up sometime. Get out of my house! What the, what the fuck is this, man? Come in, I'm gonna stab you with my jolly brawly. I have a baby to protect in here. That's right, you stupid bitch. You're oh, someone needs to not be changed. You. There you go. I should be teaching you things instead of telling you my dream, shouldn't I? Who else do I have to talk to? And you never call me a stupid cow. Oh, you never call me a stupid cow. My fair lady. Promise me you'll never talk about yourself the way Mummy does, okay? Oh, Mummy talks about herself or the way how Mummy talks about you? I'm confused. Alright, we'll check the proper suit next. I don't need that for a moment. Check those in there. Um, yeah, this looks fine. I've rotten potatoes, which probably better without. But I'll find someone who'll buy those off me and I'll make a decent bit of money. Right, so closest access hatch is all the way up here. Alterations. So I want to go up, left, first, right, and just all the way up. I'm going right now, aren't I? Yeah. Right, is right. Left.
get away. So this right by here, I believe. More suitable time of day now as well, so. Yeah, this is the right one. Oops. Also got a shop here, so the corner pub. They might buy some of the crap off me. I think I've been in there though, I think I was literally just in there. You take your job. You're looking fine today. Did you hear? They've caught Bobby Jack. Is that Sorry, mustache. Did you hear? Mrs. Sapper found a body buried in her garden. Lucky it didn't blow her up. There's one got buried in their garden. Couldn't be better, thanks. <laughs> Lovely day for it. Ah, oh, the Hastings! I thought you'd turned into. Uh, oh, never mind. Here you are. What? I'm not Arthur oh, Hastings. Too long. I can't wait to see how they fixed up Lud Hall. How have you been? I learned a new patty cake routine. Do you want to try it? Yes. Well, look at you. You know, I think someone's looking for you. Is a Bobby by me? Hello. Got anything yummy in you? Not sure if I agree with you selling the uh, the rotten mushrooms. I sold you, mind. Um, where the hell am I supposed to go to get that side? But fuck, I got twenty-one. What is this? Crafty weapons. Uh, where I would half a square. Oh. Heal better. What's this one? I don't have one which is like reduces the uh, ingredients and gives me double. It's essentially the same thing, but the other way around. But I'd rather less ingredients required. I don't want to like fantastic. grass on anyone or anything, you know. But there's supposed to be a side quest here, and it no. Oh, fuck, better move. M my baby's dying. No, are here? Don't mind me. On me jollies and what have you. I finished a side quest called Alteration. I have. Stupid game. Tricking me to think there was a side quest about when there really wasn't. What did I ever do to you? Prisoners Why would you do that to me? Playing with my emotions. Right, so we gotta go to this rat home place. Oh, it's miles away. Oh, won't you please take me there? Mind the gap, please. Alright, so we are now in a new area of the game, I believe. Oh, we got an achievement. Set foot on every island. Hey, hey. Hey, 
empty syringe. Give me those, you filthy Vespian. What's this? Ooh. Give me that, you filthy Vespians. I won't let anyone take my little girls away. How do you plan to manage that? You mustn't lie to them. I'm not. They said, how do you plan? Whoosh, that's bot. Need to drop my phone in. Oh, look, there's a broom. I want to leave. Why won't you let me leave? Use any trap access. Yes, yeah. Oh, fucking hell. Right as rain, right as rain. Lovely weather. Get four toxic waste water. I think I'm gonna chuck on a gas mask. <laughs> there we go. Ah, get that nice green air. Well, it certainly lives up to the name. Oh, it's the Pied Piper! Hey, hey, that's cool. Been reading the new Turtle comics, as you may already know from one of my previous videos. I'm going to have to actually do an updated one of those soon. Because I bought like a bundle of 40 of those Turtle comics uh, about two weeks or so after I recorded the video showing the issues that I have. I think these guys have the plague. There's an achievement for getting the plague and uh, curing yourself, so I may do that now, actually. Um, do I have the cure for the plague on me? If I don't, then I'm not going to do it. Increases stamina. Removes symptoms of plague. So yeah, I do have an actual syringe. Shir Syringe to cure the plague. Oh, oh God! You gone? Ah! Oh, yeah, you hit me. No, I mentioned doing it. I didn't mean to do it now. Go on, go away. Ah! You're gonna give me the plague. Just give me the plague. Stop killing me. Ah! Hail! Yeah, I'm going fucking have it, you bastards. Right, I just remembered. Doesn't this teach? Doesn't this make me immune to? Yeah, I can't get the plague in this. Fucking hell, man. There we go. One of them's dead. Yeah, and take some damage. I've got a better web. Oh fuck, I got him away. What's wrong, love? Too afraid to give me the plague? Yeah. Yeah. Come on. Yeah, coward. Couldn't even give me the plague if you tried. You have this okay, win. Alright. Let's continue our journey. Can't you just let me travel in peace? I have like no good weapons. For some reason, I left my cleaver.
These take a while to use, so this. Right, fuck off, my mate. Okay, I'm getting fed up with this, so I'm just gonna put my padded outfit back on. Run faster and longer, and suffer less damage while falling. So I'm just gonna go all out. I can't get infections now, I take less damage. Oh, yeah. Basically, I'm amazing. Okay. Yes, right, Jeff. Wanker. Wanker. <laughs> Can I make. Um, yeah, I need to make some medical bombs. I'll use one of my healing bombs. Healing bomb, baby little healing bomb. I want healing bomb. I want. She's just the way I want her to be. A million times harder than TNT. Bomb, healing bomb. Can I grab these ones now? Off. Feel the wrath of Majoli Broly. Majoli Broly. Oh, see, this takes way too much effort to kill one guy with a plague. I can't. What are you a fucking plague victim for Christ's sake? Oh no! Let's go after her, because that guy's bleeding now, so he shouldn't take too long to die. If we're lucky, he'll just die on his own. There we go, he's dead. He's taking too long. Oh, bleed. Ah, she's bleeding. Oh, come on! Fuck off! Regret to the fucking fish. It's kind of like cheating to use the items like that in the inventory in the middle of a fight. Grim, oh, okay, okay, let's. That one won't take long to die. Especially if I keep smacking her in the face. But after... There we go, there's one dead. After I kill these two, I'm going to swap my burglar outfit and try and be more sneaky. So I don't mind killing or fighting one at a time, but fucking three at once with a shit umbrella. I'm not sure if that works. It doesn't seem to do anything. Oh, you're bleeding to death. You can bleed faster. Not me. No, no, no. Fuck. Aha, they're both bleeding now. Oh, 
a lucky then if you want to die back. Right. Oh baby, I wouldn't do this for anybody else. Look, we really need this. Right, we're going into stealth mode. We've got to go all out now. Because I'm... I'm going to go for that one. Sprinting makes no noise. So yeah, I need to go for more of the... Uh... Expect to good, see some good. mutated Cheshire cat watching <laughs> from one of these trees. <laughs> That's cool. Oh. Where do I get the key card to this? Of course, there's no hack option. Cause light bleeding. Does mine cause light bleeding? Damn it, I was hoping I had like he super heavy bleeding. Be very careful now. And the fact that that fucking pipe wrench doesn't work is really annoying. Ah, come on, she's nearly dead. Batteries will get. Oh shit. Two seconds, gotta plug my controller in. Oh, well, you're never gonna get married if you treat men like that. There you go. So I should be uh, recording my voice again. And my health is low. I need the key card. How the hell am I supposed to get in there? Ah! Wish I noticed that sooner. Especially if there's more enemies, because if there's more, I really could have not. I could have used not having that fight. Or I could have done without uh -huh. that fight. I was sure Antoine had another lab, but he always said it was my imagination. A lab partner knows. Blood. Please stand by for decontamination. 
And a drink tap water has joy in it. Please proceed into the lab. Oh shit. Well, the worst case, I'll have, to, I'll have to drink the scotch. But, you know, they, they go for a good price. The winning argument. Can I use that? Yes! I can use the winning argument. Testing Formula A317. Subject is a downer from the village. Retrieved from the Garden District September 12, 1964. Tests negative for plague. But we don't matter. Just because we can't take joy. That gives you the right to stop us with plague. Calm down. This experiment has approval from Dr. Verloc himself. Oh, give me that. Everybody knows we have to do something. This is something. Look, just drink it down. There's a good girl. Why don't you drink it? For science! Right, there's two people in there. God, bottoms up! God! No! I'm going to play that again because I missed a bit at the end. That sounds really interesting. Testing Formula A317. Subject is a downer from the village. Retreat from the Garden District September 12th. Okay, does not take much to kill them with this bad boy. You never believe the day mummy's had. Best first aid kit. It doesn't matter. Just because we can't take joy. That gives you the right to stop us with plague. Calm down. This experiment has approval from Dr. Verloc himself. Stop, Dr. Verloc! Tommy Kingsmill drank your fucking test tube and he was a bloody dead mushroom farm by dawn. Everybody knows we have to do something. This is something. Look, just drink it down. There's a good girl. Why don't you drink it? For science! How did you get out of your... God! Bottoms up! God! No! Right. Oh! Bother! Like Does he all need to be dead? Not quite. Completely dead. Oh, she, ah, shit, and there's the doctor that I need to, uh... Be gone! Get out, get out of it! Be gone, cretins! Okay. Um... Let's put my padded suit back on so I take less damage. Oi! Yeah, fucker. Go on, go on, get out of it. Oh, you fucking yuppie. So you take a block like that and then swam and block on that one and then I'll crop him and then I'll block that one and then I swat him. You know what you got, sunshine? What you got? You got nothing. Feel the wrath of me, bro jolly brolly. Get out of it, you bastard. And that's for ditching me for the posh girls in year seven. And why the fuck do you have a mushroom on you? And you, where did you get where did you get those mushrooms? What's this key card doing here? 
I bet whoever left it was wearing a dress without pockets. Pipe wrench, strange meat, rotten apples. It's not for me. Uh, Borgular suit, in case I need. Ooh. Grab the ladder, sunshine, grab the ladder. Not an option. Oh, no, what was that? <gasps> There's rotten apples and more rotten apples and oh my god look there's rotten cabbages I know some people in Wellington Wells who love them some rotten apples I'm nearly dead I'm nearly dead. I got not much health and I'm nearly dead. Yeah. Um. And I have no healing items. This is becoming a fantastic day. Okay, now, based on this thing pouring out, now I think I need my gas mask. I suppose I just shove my canteen in there and hope it doesn't burn my full canteen. I hope Harry's right about getting the mercury out. Well, this was much more useful, uh, useless than I hoped it would be. Right, I'm hoping for miracles now. By the way, let's go to the shop. We go here. Track access hatch. What really? Well, isn't that spiffing? It's going to be filled with fucking plague victims though, isn't it? No, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah! Right, let's take this off. I really hope there's nothing in here to fight me, or very little. Rubbing alcohol. Oh, there's a lockpick. Oh. Brilliant. Now I won't need to cross all those bridges. That's all there is to this one. Okay. Um. Mum, 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 mum. Closest one to me, who's this one? Well. That's enough of being here. So I have to travel to the house of Mouse. And see what we can do, really. Because I don't think there's many options left to us at the moment. Childbirth. You barely remember the misery. We don't have to leave my parents in the woods after all. <laughs> <laughs> oh, nice, uh, nice message to our mums to be, but then, uh, how much? Oh, fuck, that's worth a lot. I'll take you to sell. I can use you guys. I think I can use them as well. I'll sell the pie. I'll sell these two bricks. And now I will make some space. Uh, 
There we go. There's no shops here, which I don't like. Like, in our first playthrough, there's little vending machines that were shops. I haven't noticed any in this one. Shit, it's night time. Get back in there. Make her sleep for seven hours. Might be um, enough for Clyde, or whatever the guy's name was, to um, have the baby carrier thing. Yeah, yeah nearly eight o'clock. The brilliant new song from our favorite new band. Craft two Mercury Amalgam. Right, so where are we now? So, oh, there's a shop here. Who's there? Show yourself. My bad, wrong outfit on. I'm walking around with the burglar outfit. It's not what it looks like. It's a hobby. I'm going the wrong way. It's not what it looks like. I'm not an idiot, I swear. I swear. I'm just sometimes an idiot. Evidence pending. What? Out for tea? Well, get back in for tea then, isn't it? Afternoon. I've got another little tinkering job for you, Lionel. I do Lionel. still enjoy these little commissions. No one else challenges my imagination quite like you do. That's a rather odd bag. What would you need that for? Oh, that's for certain compounds that have to be kept at a very specific temperature and pressure. Aren't you clever? Hmm. Well, it might take a little while, but I think I can figure it out. Come on back in a little while. In a little while. Have you got my chemical bag? Not quite yet. I had no idea you had to be so careful with chemicals. Give me another little while. Morning! Hi then, Lionel. Have you got any healing items? Because I, I cannot be asked to make them. No. Alright, give me some short spikes then, my lad. Uh, what else you got? Yeah, I'll take that. And I'll take that. I know, Lionel, my friend. I got some things for you to take. Take that. Take that. Take that. Fuck, he actually gives me the full 50. I don't want that. I got a pie for you, my son. Uh, what else we got here? Some strange meat. How much you Wellington Wellians? Love that sort of thing. 17 rotten mushrooms, my God. How the hell your guts survive it? Couldn't tell you. Wouldn't want to know either. We got a bit of free bricks. I appreciate your custom. I hope to see you again soon. Shops closed until tomorrow. Right, let's go home. Sort of ironic. I became a chemist, considering what Mum did. If you think about it. We're going to do this the quick way, which means walking past the headmistress. But we're not going to do it the quick way, we're going to do it the smart way as well. We're going to find where her um, battery is and we're going to break her. She hasn't got a wire, which means I can't break her. Great. Great. That is not what I wanted to find out. Um, is there another shop around here? No, I'm past it. Alright. I'll find somewhere else to sell the, uh... 
the other stuff. Right as rain. Alright, if there's anyone in my house, I'm gonna smack them so hard with this. Huh? With this club. It inflicts non lethal damage. My door's locked now, so no one can get in. So if that means if someone's in here, they can't get out. Yeah, you got lucky this time. People who aren't here. Alright, so what have I got to make? Yeah, this is it. Alright, next ingredient, pituitary extract. Stuart Adam. Back to the chemist. Where the hell's the chemist? Cutty's shop. Hmm. I was tinkering with my old extractor, wasn't he? Maybe I can buy it back from him. Or borrow it. Either way, right as rain. So yeah, we're just going to do this last bit now, and then we'll end the video. But obviously, a little bit could actually happen between now and then, so I'd recommend sticking around just to see what happens, basically. Could be interesting stuff. See, look, you nearly missed out on me finding some metal bits, and can imagine how much more dreadful your life would be for not knowing that I found metal bits in a bin. And cloth, and something else, but I didn't read what it was. Oh, look at that, look at all them. Honestly, your life has gotten so much better for sticking around. Run! Run! Ha ha! Sunshine, lollipops, and rainbows everywhere. The wonderful is what I feel when we're together. Right, first shop now, so if we go up here, turn right, second, left, we'll be on the same road as a shop. And then we'll also unlock a little bit more of the map. So on the second right, I'll bring up the map just to see if we've uh, found anything new in the area. Alright, uh, so there's the first left. Toy shop. Just before it, instead. So no, as it turns out, there was nothing new, but now we know. And there is power in knowledge, my friends. Power. Ooh! The baby feeder is available now. Doctor! I'm stuck. Wait a minute. There's a hatch. Well, I'll be jiggered. Oh, no, uh, yeah, I already knew about this one. How can I help you? Well, Mr. Butcherman. Send my money, shall we? I'm hoping to sell some rotten food to you, essentially, old bean. But it would appear as though that is not in the cards We're today. A new shipment any day now. Alright, so from where we are now, we want to go up, left, and then right to go to the shade dealer. Then. Oh, I'm not going right now, am I? No. Up, left. 
I recall where the shady dealer was. He was in an alleyway in a bin of sorts. Yeah. Just by here. And there we are, he's in there. I've got stuff you don't even know you want. Come on over here and unpack your Rolling tree. pin, the pipe down. Ooh, yeah, I'll take two of those. Take more, actually, I changed my mind. Crash. No, I don't need any of those. Can you take some of this nonsense off me? Why do they all... Like, why do all shops only accept the same stuff? Yeah, well, take some glass bottles, boyo. A nod's as good as a wink to a blind back. Am I right, or am I right? Yeah, why not? So the only rotten f people are willing to buy is rotten mush uh, mushrooms, for some reason. No, I don't need to follow the map, I just remembered, because uh, this one does actually show itself on my screen. Hmm. I could use a bit of money. And I bet Stuart wouldn't mind having a few Sally specials to sell. The old top shelf. Lovely. Ah, there he is. Great. Thought I'd pop in to see what's new. Increases stamina. Do you have... Oh, he has four of those seed thingies that I need. We'll grab all four of those. What is this? Alright, we'll buy two of those. Get two of those as well. Counteract Choi. Anti-choke. Healers damage while breathing toxic fog. Oh my days, that's amazing! What shit can I sell you? Need to get some money. Uh, I'll be two minutes. I'll get rid of that. Keep the antiseptic. Um. Oh well, I'll just have to accept I've got less money Ciao, now, won't I? Darling. Sally! Oh, you never come by anymore. Well, Fiona. Oh, Cerberus. I. She's never understood me, Sally. Not like you do. She mentioned, among other things, that you've improved my extractor. Have you still got my extractor? I have. Oh, you're going to be very proud of me. It's much quicker now. Might even uh, sting a little less. You hey. improved it. Would you like to test it out? You sure Fiona won't murder you? Oh, oh she barks, but she don't bite <laughs> much. <laughs> I'll let you know how it works. Honey, pituitary extract from someone who's been exposed to mustard gas. Mikey Forrester's clinic ought to have a patient or two like that. I'll send him a note on the blower. Alright, okay, so we still got a bit of a distance to do this quest. So we're going to end this by here. Uh, I hope you've enjoyed. Uh, if you have, it'd mean a lot if you could like the video to let me know that you've enjoyed it. And um, check out some more videos on the channel. You know, I've got tons of stuff up on the channel. I've got gameplay, i got playthroughs, i got um, card videos like card packs, pack openings, i got model reviews, i got amiibo videos, i got comics. Um, I got a video coming up soon I'll be doing in the next few days um, another like anime con video be showing you um, like some of the things got at the uh, anime con this weekend and giving you my thoughts and opinions of it so that'll be my second one of those videos um, I got some loot crate videos as well you know literally tons of stuff for you to uh, check out and so I'm sure there's plenty that you'll enjoy All right, take care have a great day and I'll see you in another video